The body was made to heal itself. Hi, I'm Dr. Gary Arthur. I'm a doctor of chiropractic and also a doctor of naturopathic medicine. My wife and I, Lisa, who's my favorite doctor, she and I moved down from Santa Cruz in 1987. We started our practice right here in Laguna Beach. And it's been so great over all these years and all these decades to help so many people. You see people get their life back and start to flourish again and their relationships get better and they get out of pain and they start feeling like they've got hope again. It's an awesome thing. So therefore, we put together chiropractic, the very best of research chiropractic with applied kinesiology, with naturopathic medicine, with homeopathy, with nutritional therapy, with blood chemistry, with neuroemotional technique to decrease the mind-body stressors, with IV nutritional therapy, with spinal decompression, with stem cell therapy and regenerative medicine and home care exercises. It's amazing to see how people's lives can change when you start integrating multiple factors from multiple different disciplines. You think about the fact that if you cut yourself, a scab it bleeds, a scab forms, and then the scab eventually falls off. You think about the fact that two little cells, one from mom, one from dad, they come together and that spark of life happens and there's a blueprint for a masterpiece. And nine months later, out comes that masterpiece, which is each of us. It's an amazing, amazing thing. Think about the fact that a healthy body makes two and a half million red blood cells every single second. Two and a half million, two and a half million, two and a half million, 250,000 white blood cells every single second. There's over 657 isolated functions of our liver alone. So you think about all these things are going on and we're not even thinking about it. So there's four main systems of the body when you look at all the healing arts around the world. There's our structural body, our muscles, our bones, our spine, our joints. There's our chemical body, our biochemical system of our hormones, our minerals, our vitamins, our physiology, our organ function. That's that whole biochemical side. Then you have the electromagnetic systems, which is what the Chinese doctors work with in acupuncture. The flow of energy through the meridian systems, magnetic systems, the Ayurvedic energy centers of the body. You think about the effect of cell phones on us. And then you think about the emotional system, the mental components, our belief systems, the traumas, the challenges, the tragedies that we've gone through, the deaths, the divorces the bankruptcies, the hurts, the breakups, all those things, those disappointments. So we have the four systems, the structural, the biochemical, the emotional, and the electromagnetic. But stress interferes with our body's ability to heal itself. That's gonna to get to the root cause problem of why the body isn't healing. So it's really finding a way to figure out what the stressors are and put together a strategy and a plan of care to decrease the stressors so the body can get back to doing exactly what it was designed to. So we invite you to consider what you want. What's important to you? What do you value? What about your health and your quality of life is important to you? What are you dealing with right now that if you weren't dealing with it, your life would be better? One of the things that helped me to make a decision to really fix my body and invest in that process and how much value it had was I just thought about well what is going to be like if my problem keeps getting worse over time because none of us gets away from the forces of gravity it's on every one of us and so I think back to the um, the Scrooge principle you know when Scrooge got visited by the ghost of Christmas past and he woke up he didn't change he got woken up by the ghost of Christmas present and looked at how bad he was, that didn't change him, but when he looked at the ghost of Christmas future and he saw how his life had amounted to nothing and people didn't like him and he was that guy that everybody detested, the guy that everybody was glad was dead, but when he woke up and realized, I'm not dead yet, and he had an opportunity to do something about it, and he did, he changed. So we all have to ask ourselves some questions. What do we want? Where's my life going? What do we want it to look like? And if I was feeling better, what would that do to the people's life that love me and that are living with me? How would it make their life if I was better? We're 
honored to have you even watching this video and considering us to be your teammate on your journey of where you want to go with your health. And we look forward to that opportunity of coming alongside you and helping you get the quality of life you're looking for.